Hey Dad, I want to show you the exercise I do in the kitchen when I'm uh, putting on the kettles and uh, just getting ready for work. It's uh, usually I do about five minutes or so a day and it's really easy. No exercise equipment needed. You can do it in your jeans or, or whatever you're wearing. It's uh, pretty good, so I want to show you. So I usually start out by putting my back into the corner of the cupboard and then my hand just in a comfortable spot for you. Just lift yourself up. See my feet, they're off the floor, they're hovering. And all I do is just kind of go left and right. And I'm twisting my whole torso. And I'm usually doing this while the kettle's boiling the water. Rotating your feet around. And then if you can, Lift yourself up, lift your knees, you don't have to do much of it, just do a couple, uh, whatever your body, once you start to feel a good feeling then stop and then move on to the next one which I lift myself up again. So my feet are dangling. I turn my toes and curl them in so they're pointing. And I'm not on my feet, but I am using them as support. And I just hold my body weight like this, and then I shift from one to the other. And now you're using your legs, your back. I stretch it all the way deep and down deep like this. If your toes hurt, then just like put regular footing. Walk out. Hold, hold. And just lean back. And right now I'm not using anything on the left, I'm just, it's all in here. Switch to the other side. And on this counter, I have the sink, so that gives me leverage. But up here, I don't have anything to grab onto. So I'm just kind of pushing down to create resistance, but I'm not really holding on to anything. And just lifting your legs, and you're really working your joints. And then another thing I do is I trace objects that I see just for something to do. Like I'm going to take my foot and trace and stretch all the way out. But if you can't do this, so just do stuff like this. Hold, just hold the counter and lift your leg as high as you can. And go. So I did a, the tracing of the entire counter. But then you can also use your knees, so I'm going to do the doors. paper. So I'm going to go back to holding the counter, stretching in the back and just using my leg, the joints, working them. Lean forward.
And there's no, I don't count any reps or anything like that. You just do whatever your body feels. Like right now, this feels really good. But when I was doing it to my other leg, it didn't feel the same. So I'm gonna work the legs differently based on whatever I, whatever I, I feel needed. I don't know if you can see that either, but I'm lifting my foot off the ground, going down, and then I'm pushing my knee all the way. And then lifting back up. And you can either lift up and down with your leg, but if that's too hard, use your arms at the same time. So I'm just tracing with my knees as much as I can. And this doesn't require any exercise equipment. No, you don't have to get changed. You can come home as soon as you walk in the door start doing this. So that's a quick one. I actually feel pretty, oh I should, there, did I? Okay, so that's a quick one. I actually feel pretty good now doing that. I only wasn't even really a workout, but I still feel amazing from doing that. I'm sure you will too, and that's all it takes. So just do a little bit until you feel good. Stop, and then later on today or tomorrow or whenever, just uh, do a different exercise. Not that same one, but go do the kettlebells that I showed you or your body weight or, or something. So anyways, I hope you liked it, and uh, I want to post some more for you. So I'll talk to you later. Bye. Say bye, Dad. Yeah.